Traffic control officer Gertrude Schaffline has worked as a school crossing guard for almost 50 years. I mean, she's a testament to selflessness and service. I mean, her, those kids are her kids. And she says that over and over, I need to get back to my kids. On September 6th, the officer chef line was working at Wellington Elementary when she was hit by a semi truck on Cane Run Road. Doctors had to amputate her leg. I talked to her at the hospital right after she had her leg amputated. She was basically apologizing and planning on when she could get back to work. Lieutenant Colonel Aaron Crowell with LMPD says Gertrude is recovering but still needs a lot of medical care. That's why her community, Valley Station, decided to step in and help. And we're here to, you know, try to raise as much funds to try to help her with her new endeavors in life and just make it as easy as possible. On Thursday, the McDonald's on Dixie Highway in Barrett Lane hosted a fundraiser for Officer Chefline. Thank you so much. Thank you. Raising more than $7,000 in the first two hours alone. Well, that's the way we are. You know, we, we give a lot of stuff to people that needs it. We're, we're good for that. Matthew Dodd, the restaurant owner, says his store will be donating 50% of its profits from mobile orders on Thursday to Officer Chefline. Other organizations like Shirley's Way and the NAACP also pitched in. As we have a good community, uh, people care about each other. Half the people that come through this drive through have stopped, you know, to hand us something on our behalf. So, you know, it's good to see that kind of support from the community. Officer Krause says while Gertrude was sorry she couldn't be there on Thursday, she feels the love and support and appreciates it greatly. She would never ask for any, any attention in this way, but we feel like it's more than deserving. Addie Miners, WLKY News.